President Donald Trump says he ordered the killing of Iran's top military leader because that man was plotting to kill more Americans. The U.S. is now sending nearly 3,000 more army troops to the Middle Middle East as reinforcements. The strike marked a major escalation in the conflict between the U.S. and Iran. That country vows harsh retaliation. President Trump used Twitter to explain his decision to launch a deadly attack against one of Iran's top officials. He writes, General Qassam Soleimani has killed or badly wounded thousands of Americans over an extended period of time and was plotting to kill many more. The president adds he should have been taken out many years ago. Qassam Soleimani was the head of the Iranian Revolutionary Guard Corps, which the U.S. considers a foreign terrorist organization. The American military targeted him as his car drove away from Baghdad International Airport. He was actively plotting in the region to take actions, a big action as he described it, that would have put dozens if not hundreds of American lives at risk. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo posted a video showing Iraqis dancing in the streets after learning the Iranian general was dead. In Iran, people gathered to mourn. The confrontation led the U.S. State Department to urge Americans in Iraq to leave the country immediately to avoid retaliation. I think it was the right move. Will there be escalation? Yes, but the escalation is not on our part. We're finally responding to continued provocations by Iran. Members of Congress were quick to respond. Most Republicans support the president's decision. But Democratic House Speaker Nancy Pelosi says America and the world cannot afford to have tensions escalate to the point of no return. She criticizes the Trump administration for carrying out the attack without congressional authorization of force. Still, America's allies like Israel support the decision. Qasem Soleimani is responsible for the death of American citizens and many other innocent people. He was planning more such attacks. President Trump deserves all the credit for acting swiftly, forcefully, decisively.